Hi students, welcome. In this video, we will understand the concept of cycle of operations. So students, for that, see here. Now, suppose this is our graph. We are taking here, we will see the two examples here. Okay. This is our pressure and this is our volume. Here also pressure, sorry, pressure and here this is our volume okay now suppose this is the point one and any process is starting now from this point one and suppose this process is going on and it's p and v that is pressure and volume is changing and this process after completing this process the end point of this process again coming to the initial point that is the start point of the process this is called the cycle of operations okay as you can see here this process is starts at this point one and this process is again returned to the point one as you can see here that that it that means its initial and final conditions are same so this is a cycle okay and another example see here suppose now this is point one this is point one over here and one process any process is starting from this point to suppose at this point to point two okay and again further this process is continues and it reaches the point three again this process is continued and it reaches to the point four as you can see here and after that this process is again continued and it reaches again to the same initial point that is p1 okay so this is our this is also the cycle of operation because see here this is this the this this cycle consists of a process uh, first process is from process point p1 to p2 is the our, our first process okay and after that the next next process is point p2 to point p3 this is our second process and from point p3 to p4 this is our third process and here from p4 to p1 this is our here fourth process as you can see here but in this series of processes or uh, processes our initial and final points or conditions or states are same so this is the cycle of operations as you can see here this is our path one path two path three or and path four but in this series of operations or series of processes in this series of processes our initial and final condition or state is same that is p1 in this case here also these processes are taking place at the variation at the changes of p1 and sorry at the change change at the change of pressure and volume these all process are, process, processes are happening but at the at the initial point that is start point of the process and at the end point that is final point of the process both the points are same that is initial and final conditions or states are same so here this is also the cycle of operations okay so students in this video we have understood what is the cycle of operations thank you students for watching this video like share and comment for this video and subscribe my channel thank you